Welcome to I'm on Satanta Sports. Many, many emails doing it on me this week. There it is. One here from Stiko in Australia says, G'day, mate. Bonza show, Jose, mate. Any chance you take the Australian job? Maybe. P.S. Could you make it play the didgeridoo? Of course, Stiko. Do it, Sven. Well. <sighs> Very nice. Other email? When? Uh, one in here from Terry Kenny in the United States of America says, Jose, you are the greatest coach in the world. You should coach the world. <laughs> Why not? This one from Yusef in Eritrea. Hi, Jose. Great show. Can you tell me why everyone, even my dog, is asking what A.V. Grant is doing as manager? Good question, Yusef. Now, the news. Shut up, Sven. David Beckham's difficulties with U.S. authorities continue. It has emerged that after making a legal maneuver in his Jeep, when Beckham was asked what was contained within his hood, the England star is reputed to have said, My head officer. Beckham was later fined $50 for illegal maneuver and $1,000 for being numb nuts. Meanwhile, in a breaking story, Arsene Wenger has hit back after a spate of heavy criticism following his teammate exit from Champions League. Although he denies the allegations made against him, the voyeur was today unavailable for comment. And finally, a quick look at the markets. And no change there then. Now, over to Wayne for our new item, Wayne's Word. <sighs> Wayne's Word, Wayne's Word, party time, excellent, well. Uh, today's word is aggregate which describes a total considered with reference to its constituent parts or gross amount in a mass or cluster, i.e. Roma were defeated 2-0 and 1-0 by us, but slaughtered 3-0 on aggregate. But Liverpool were lucky to win 5-3 on aggregate, if you consider there was a definite penalty claim in the first leg. All right then, there's my word for the day. Aggregate. Wayne's word, Wayne's word, excellent art time. Well, okay, let's go to the phones. Line two. Hello. Voyeur, I told you we don't want you on this show. The feeling is mutual, but I have to say that I'm more than a little bit appalled by the outrageous lies perpetuated by your show about me. Lies? What lies? You know what lies. You insist on calling me voyeur with the fake newspaper headlines. They are not fake. The people out there will not swallow it. Why not? Because it's not true. I have proof. What proof? On YouTube. Ridiculous. No. Put Wenger the Voyeur into YouTube and there it is. You are a little bit deranged. You want to see it? There is nothing to see. Do it, Sven. Surely this is legal minefield. Shut up. Do it. Well. What? Wenger? Get out of my bedroom! Get out! I can see you! Get the out of my house! Go and don't come back! There you are? This is quite preposterous. If for starters, there's no proof it is me. No? Line one. Hello, caller. Jess, this explains everything for me. Go on, caller. I know how difficult this is for you, but tell me your story. Last week, I was in a shop minding my own business and I could clearly feel the ice looking at me, penetrating me. There you are, voyeur. Evidence is overwhelming. What evidence? So, he was in a pastry shop in Liverpool. Big deal. Who said anything about a pastry shop, voyeur? Well, I... Ho, oh, a pastry shop. Rafa? Jess? Were you in pastry shop? Jess. Uh, That's brilliant, uh, Two birds with the one stone. Sneed. Uh, well, uh, don't be encouraging him. Line three, Mr. Alex, did you see the voyeur? Absolute disgrace. Is the boy there? 
Of course. No, 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 I don't want to go home. This is boss, this is boss. It's time for your tea, Wayne. Come on. Put that. Wayne. Ah. There you go, Wayne. Run along now. Good. See you next week, so. Wayne. What? You forgot something. Oh.